So, um, yeah. Bullet lost one of his eyes. Just kidding, it's actually inside drawing. So it has been a very long time since I made a video, but today I'm gonna be starting a new series. I don't know what I'm gonna call it yet, but it's basically gonna be me touching up stuff on bullet. For example, today I'm gonna be working on the side skirt right there. But yeah, this is a new series of me fixing a bullet. And here's the list. So first on the list is adjust the side skirts. Now, you can't really tell, but I kind of, uh, hold on a second, I'm switching to autofocus. I uh, kind of ruined my side skirt over here. See how it kind of pokes out a little? Well, I kind of jacked it up from the wrong point of the car, and uh, yeah, don't do that. But I'm gonna try fixing it today. I'm gonna jack up the car, see what I can find. Maybe try to adjust a little bit because, as you could tell from earlier, it actually was poking out a little. But it's been rubbing in here right there. Try to get it focus a little bit. Right there. I don't know how well you can tell, but it's just rubbing right there. I'm gonna try pushing it down a little bit, see what I can do, and go from there. But I do have a bunch of other stuff I'm going to be doing as well. Like obviously it's just some maintenance stuff and all that. And yeah. kind of weird holding but it's getting very cold in here I'm gonna be laying on the ground so I'm not gonna be picking up the camera for a while I'm just gonna be doing like a film montage not gonna be talking gonna close the door turn on the heater let's go Mud flap <coughs> is out. All right, I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea what I'm looking for. So, I took out the mud flap, as you guys saw, sorry if you can't hear me because of the heater, but I took out the mud flap and now I'm trying to figure out how to adjust that to go back in. Hopefully I can figure out something, but I'm gonna take a flashlight, see what I can look for, and I will come back and show you. One eternity later. So, ignore the heat in my headphones right now. I fixed the side skirt, so basically what I had to do is take it off, adjust it, and now there's no rubbing happening here. So I'm gonna probably clean this up a little bit, make it look a little bit better, but no more rubbing. So now I just need to figure out what to do about that. So that's the main thing right now, is just trying to fix that. Still got the mud flap off and everything, so I'm gonna figure out what I need to do next. Two hours later. All right, I think I found the problem. So, side shirts are all put back together, but see how this is still loose? Well, now I can push it back and it will be fine. I had to bend back, I don't know how well you can see it, but I had to bend back my pinch weld because I don't know if I did it or if someone else did it, but my pinch weld was really bent. So I've straightened it out. I'm gonna try sanding it maybe a little bit. If not, I'm just gonna touch it up with some paint. Uh, I'm not gonna do like my touch-up paint or anything like that. I'll probably just get some spray paint, spray paint it off so it doesn't rust. But besides that, it's going just fine. I do need to uh, find a point to put a screw in so it, uh, the side skirt will stay. So that's where I'm at so far. Everything's working fine. Put my blood, sweat, and tears into this car now. <laughs> uh, cut my, I got my arm a little bit there. Nothing bad, but you know, just still working on it. So. Whew. Can't wait until this thing's done. <laughs> it's never gonna be done. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. 
All right, I just finished. Looks a lot cleaner down there. All, yeah, it's all one connecting piece again. Now let's see the final test, see if it rubs. And I still need to put that trim piece back in, but survey says, no rubbing, it's good, done. So I'm gonna walk around, looks okay there. Check the other side to see if it looks the same as the other. Okay, and good, all right.